Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to another segment of Let's Draw Cartoons with Rick. Today, we're going to draw a junkyard dog. So let's grab our pencils and start drawing. So first thing I will draw, I'm going to make him look kind of angry. So we'll give him this angry eye. Maybe put a little circle around the little dot that's in there. Then we'll draw a ziggy zaggy line on the top. Then let's draw his ears. So we'll make it come around and then down. And then two little lines that come down. And do the same thing on the other side. We'll do a, a loopy ear that comes up and then down. And then two little lines on the other side. And even though dogs don't really have eye patches, let's give this guy an eye patch so it looks kind of tough. So we'll draw like an oval and then we'll fill that oval in with some black. So we'll get a little thicker pencil and black that in. Then we'll draw his nose, which is like a slightly curved line. And then a line that goes down, a line that comes up, and a line that goes down and down, and then up, and then over, and then up again. Now dogs' noses are wet, and we drew wet noses before by putting an oval at the top. And then in the spaces around that oval, we're going to just fill it in with black. So we'll just fill that in all the way around, fill that guy in, there we go, now he has a big black shiny nose. Then we'll draw the side of his mouth, his face will come up, touch the bottom of his nose and then we'll make a kind of a mean mouth that comes out to the side. Then we'll draw the side of his face and come back up. Let's put some little circles in there. Let's give him a bit of a scar. So make him look kind of tough and some hash marks like he's been in a fight. Actually a bunch of fights. Then we'll give him some ziggy zaggy teeth. Makes him look kind of growly. Then we'll do his body. We'll do a round part that comes up like that. Now let's put his arms out to the side. Two little lines. Let's give him a fist. So we'll make one little line there and then we'll come around and do two more curly lines and then we'll bring his thumb around that way. We'll do the same thing here. Let's draw a straight line and then we'll curl it around. Two more curly lines and we'll draw his thumb. Next we'll do his legs. We'll do two sets of curved lines so he's like kind of bow-legged but he's like in a real rough tuple stance. And then we'll Curl up the top of his foot and come back. We'll do the same thing on this side. We'll curl up the top, come back. And we've drawn pawed animals before. We have to add a couple of little lines on the inside that look like his toes. And we'll give him a tail with little ziggy zaggy lines coming down. And maybe a couple of more hashtags so he looks rough. And if you want, you can take an eraser. Usually I don't like to erase during a lesson, but kind of you have to do it on this one. We'll make it look like his ear has got a little piece taken out of it. Somebody bit part of his ear off, a little piece falling down. And then we'll give him some stray rough hairs. So put those all over him like this. Keep going with a couple, a couple of just rough hairs and... Maybe pieces of junk on the ground, like a tin can. Maybe a bone off to the side. But this is a dog you don't want to run into when you're walking down an alley. And there you go. This is how you draw a rough and tumble junkyard dog. So make sure you check your email for the next segment of Let's Start Cartoons. Or you can go to the archives and watch a lot more videos on how to draw all kinds of fun and silly cartoon characters. So thanks for stopping by today, and we'll see you next time. So long.